kinda looks positive to me. <sighs> oh no. So Emily got it too. Confirmed. Oh man. Come here and look. What does it mean? Corona? Yeah. And you? I also have. I have two lines. Yeah. What does two lines mean? Corona! <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't say if you can also get three lines. Yeah. But it's okay. Two. You'll get better, okay? Uh -huh. We're gonna fight Corona. <laughs> that means no more masks! Mommy doesn't have to wear masks anymore because she also got it. <laughs> and we can hug. Yeah! Wait a minute, wait a minute! We, we can hug because we both see. Now we can hug! I missed you! I miss you too! Oh, now we can sleep together again! Uh -huh. <laughs> because we're both sick! <laughs> Okay, so we're both sick and it's a pretty clear line. We can do this. We got this. You know what me and Esther do when we leave? Yeah. What? What? We do this. <laughs> oh no, but it's okay. We're gonna be fine. It's already lunchtime and Emily fell asleep. I think she has fever again because it's been six hours since she took paracetamol and baka uh, nila like that because she never really sleeps bug. Uh, so I think she has um um pansin in yung kalat kasi hindi ko kaya. Um bawi na ng pagkatapos. Anyway, um yeah, I think she fell asleep because she might have fever again. I'll give her medicine later. I'll check her temp in a while. Um, our friends brought over some apples and uh, lemons and croissants. And I wanted to bring Amelie for uh, testing. But I um, feel kind of dizzy. As in, pag tumatayo ako, para mikot yung mundo ko. So... Uh, hindi ako sure kung kaya ko siyang dalin because we can only walk we cannot take public transport but you're allowed to go out to um, to test, to get a test but yeah, of course we don't want to take public transport because so we're going to expose other people mm, yeah, but I have to get her to a test center because otherwise she cannot be um, recorded as recovered and she can't get her certificate of recovery from corona and that's as good as uh, being vaccinated so i don't know what to do but anyway hey everyone And we had a fever again. <coughs> I'm in the kitchen because she's already sleeping. Actually, she's been sleeping since uh, 6 p.m. Uh, I gave her a better Sorry, my, uh, I had to change my batteries. Um, <coughs> anyway, my symptoms are better today. I didn't take any paracetamol. Uh, for a headache and when I'm standing too long na ako and then yeah Amelie had fever again and she's been sleeping sleeping for a few hours now and I'm trying to fall asleep but I can't obviously yeah I don't know it must be the 
the isolation maybe I don't know but well I don't think it's the isolation because I'm the kind of person who doesn't mind staying home uh, I'm an introvert a lot of things happened Amelie broke her finger and they wanted to do surgery and I had to decide if I'm gonna let them do surgery and you know uh, it's hard to be here by yourself and do but all the pressure is on you to decide what's best for your kid and it's different when you are actually the one who has to decide on it like what if you decide uh, and then it's wrong so I decided against the surgery and then now we got COVID and she was supposed to go to the doctor to a new doctor this week to check if her finger is healing and we couldn't go so that got delayed she was supposed to get an x-ray to check if they can remove the cast how it's doing and then COVID um, when I got here the first thing that I did is get vaccinated because I thought ko dalawa lang kami ni Amelie what if she gets COVID or I get COVID and then um, I get it bad because I'm not vaccinated what am, where, where is she gonna be or who's gonna take care of her but when it actually happens you know it's easier said than done when it actually happens now that we have COVID even though our symptoms are flu-like symptoms it still kind of puts you in a very hopeless place like It's just a lot at once. So, yeah, I'm having a hard time sleeping because I just feel so hopeless and scared. Gosh, I look terrible. Oh my goodness. Anyway, I just uh, thought of <coughs> capturing that because I know I'm not the only one who feels this way. And yeah, it's different when it's just you and your kid and you're not really sure if anyone else has got you, you know, if something happens. Yeah. <sighs> Thank you for listening. I don't know if I will uh, upload this, but if you see it on the vlog, it means... If you're watching this, it means... Uh, I guess it made sense to me when I was editing it to include this <sighs> which makes me very uncomfortable when I think of it but we'll see I'll try to get some sleep and I'll see you tomorrow day four bye so today today is a very sunny day so it's uh, around about today, day five, day four. <coughs> Not on about Wednesday. <laughs> day four, day two ni Amelie. So I'm gonna cook mongo. I'm gonna cook uh, ano to? mushroom sisig. 
And oh man, I'm I have a little more energy. I feel like I have a little more energy today so I can cook. Uh, I feel a bit better again today, but I have a hair fall. As in, ang lala ng hair fall ko. That's what I noticed. So, I'm gonna check if it will continue. I hope not. But, yeah, I'm gonna prepare our dishes first, our ulam. And I'll see you later. So, I'm cooking the mungo. And then, I'm also gonna cook the uh, mushroom seasoning. This is oh, not focusing. This is for the pizza. Ni <laughs> ko, but yeah, I'm gonna cook the mushroom seasoning now. Mango mm -hmm. is cooking pa, and here's the mushroom seasoning. I think I have to add a little more butter, but looking good. I'll give Amelie a bath first. Lower the heat. Hi, so we just came back from the test center. Um, here in Germany, you're allowed to break quarantine if you're gonna go out to get tested. And I have to... Amelie, remove now your jacket, bitte. And your shoes. And here in Germany, um, you have to get the positive test in the test center so you can get the free PCR otherwise you have to pay for it which is uh, 60 or 70 euros and then bitte aufräumen <coughs> Amelie bitte aufräumen okay hello hello what did you do I did COVID test yeah so she has to get the po positive antigen test at the test center so the, D the DOH here can also record it and then she can get a PCR. For vaccinated people, 7 days, you can go test yourself at the test center. If it's negative, you can break quarantine. So I have until Wednesday and Amity has starting today. I uh, was supposed to get her vaccinated. Yeah, uh, vaccinated tested yesterday but um, I didn't uh, have the strength and Amelie had fever so we couldn't go out. She has to do her house of Gavin now. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna explain. We're gonna take another test here at home. Same test that we took yesterday because her test now came back negative. Okay. Can I do the test? Thank you. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Other side. Don't bend me. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Okay, and then I'll get a little. Can I look at Mama? Don't do like that, it's gonna hurt you. Look at mommy. <laughs> Look at the camera. Look at mama. Don't laugh. Wait, <laughs> <laughs> Nanny. <laughs> Wait, not yet. What can you mean in the camera? <laughs> Look up. Don't do that. Masakit yan. Mahala. Wait. <laughs> Dali. <laughs> Okay. 
using my phone camera but we have to go to a different test center now <sighs> and <coughs> I'm out of breath <coughs> it's quite far away and Amelie has her roller so it's a bit hard with her finger but she's enjoying because now she's going to roll okay I'll pull you now hmm? I'll pull you no <laughs> we just got back and I almost gave up because they only only find out that they don't do PCR tests anymore so, baliwala yung nilakad namin. And my cough was getting worse while we were walking. It was so far away. Anyway, I'm now cooking the sisig mushroom. Wala lang on sile, yung green na sile na ginigamit natin sa sinigang. You can only buy it though sa Asian store. And here's the mungo. I didn't cook any rice anymore because I'm not pa my food so I'll just eat it this way and this is my first attempt at mushroom sisig so okay lang because it's good I just need the chili next time it's just an experiment because I ko yung mushroom school but now I know I can do it Amelie is requesting for the mashed potatoes on hine Okay, there you go. Mashed potatoes. I'm doing mashed potatoes now. I'm going to luto today. How Germans peel their mashed potatoes. Even if they're still hot. Comes off like that. Pita nyo ba? So, since it's hot, put it on a uh, gabba, oh my gosh, on a fork. <laughs> my words are, and then just peel it off. Morning, it's day, Sunday noon, day five. Amelie and I are making waffles. For breakfast. For breakfast. Say good morning. Good morning. Did you sleep well? Yeah, I'm gonna fix the table for a gingerbread house day. Okay, that's you. Okay, so don't mind how I look, but uh, it was my first night na hindi ako nagising because of coughing. Because uh, every night, uh, nagigising ako mga three to four times. Because I have to drink water. And uh, tonight was the first night that I did not cough at all. Wait. But this morning I still have cough and a bit of sipon. This is our activity for today. Ta da! A gingerbread house, which we forgot to do on Christmas because we. Uh, we went on vacation over Christmas and we forgot to do it, so at least there's uh, my purpose. Na siya. Uh, this is our quarantine activity, it's gonna expire in June, so we might as well do it now. May panlasa na kami, so that's okay. Okay, Amelie's cleaning up the table. Uh, and dito pa rin kami natutulog because it's more. And I feel better! She's, she feels better now today. So we're gonna clean up the table and don't panic me to look living room because I just feel like it's sunnier, it's brighter and um, it will help us heal faster. So her waffle from scratch as well. So we're gonna eat breakfast now. 
and then I'm gonna clean up and now I'm gonna do the gingerbread house or Amelie can decorate the gingerbread house while I'm cleaning. Okay, so we went out to get tested while this is drying up. <coughs> I'm gonna take a video of your design. In the back. But uh, not yet. There's a Christmas tree, Hansel and Gretel, and a witch, and there's a cat that looks like a piggy. And there's attention to the detail, the gingerbread man. And this is the back. So, now it's time to eat it. Eat Wait! It. What? Make sure to like and subscribe and click that like button. <laughs> Galing ah! Okay, did you hear it guys? Like and subscribe and click that like button. Okay, go!